way, 0-1 so far this season, lost on the road at VCU, actually put up a pretty good fight against the Rams a couple of days ago. Blackshear Jr., yes, and the foul. The sophomore from Toronto, Alexander Walker, on the drive. It's turned away, Blackshear Jr. is swatted down low. In transition for Effiani, jams it home, and a foul. All those guys, you can just see him. He's a different looking player than when he arrived here. On the drive, the floater off the window and in. Nicely done that time from Nate Johnson. So Gardner Webb, four to three. In the early goings, down low for Blackshear Jr. Tufts it up and in for two. Look out for Outlaw in transition. to Robinson in the corner. There he is. Virginia Tech's Isaiah Wilkins, a freshman from Winston-Salem, North Carolina. Alexander Walker, the lefty teardrop goal. Uh, he, he has a great left hand. Gardner Webb has seven turnovers now. Down low for Wilkins. Right on through. Yeah, he's got one of those bodies. He creates space. Gardner Webb, right back the other direction. Jameson. Swatted away by a red hill. Once again, this time it's P.J. Hall. Like what he sees, slows it down off to Blackshear Jr. and starts up the offense. He can shoot it. You bet. Yeah, well, that's not the last time we'll see that little two-man game at the top of the key. Saved by Wilkins. Really nice effort. Second shot and a save. Look Good that. feed. P.J. Hall lays it up and off the dish from Alexander Walker. One of his great passes come with that left hand. No look through traffic. Tough physical play down low. Right back to Brandon Miller. He scores it with the left. Ten minutes, but he can really help this team. Out to Robinson. The lefty fires. Back rim no. Rebound Wilkins. He'll pop from 15, knock it down. Isaiah Wilkins getting good minutes. The freshman from Winston-Salem, North Carolina. Here's Turner with the basketball. Christian Turner, the junior guard from Atlanta, has it taken away. One on two for Hill. Smacked off the backboard that time. Perez fell to Gardner Webb. Coach Kraft thought was in part because he's a bit of an awkward athlete, doesn't play all that fluid. The layup is good, and the foul for Alexander Walker. Alexander Walker feeds for Horn, and that's knocked away. Two on one for the moment to Perez with the lefty layup for two. Please to get the high percentage look for a change. But Perez has four points. Here's Wilkins. Yes! Big impact from the freshman so far. Her game had about five and a half of them. And Wilkins has seven points so far. Effiani rattles it through. Ooh, that was under good pressure, too. Looking for Alexander Walker down low, matched up with Effiani. Yes, right on through. Yeah. As well. Good post up move. You didn't see him do much of that last season. Fade and fire this time for Cornwall. A swish on the baseline. What's the next foul there, unless it's offensive? Puts Virginia Tech at the free throw line. Here's Perez. Floater. Yes. Justin Robinson, the bounce pass to PJ Horn. Can't finish, but a Matt Hill can just kind of scooted it over the rim for two. Into the season ranks 15th in the country, which is tied for the highest preseason ranking ever. Three quarter yes from Isaiah Wilkins. What a debut for the freshman. Ten points leads Virginia Tech in scoring. Into the corner. Three ball is up. It is good, and the foul. Nate Johnson to the free throw line for an and one. Justin Robinson with five points so far tonight, as well as three assists. Good feed down low and a good finish that time. Nicely done by Dufial. <laughs> Alexander Walker challenged but connects. Final two minutes. Back out to Effiani. Pops from the free throw line and wow. connects. <laughs> that was something. Here's Christian Turner. Free ball from Johnson. Yes. Good penetration right there. Four. A little full court pressure here. Into the corner. Johnson heaves it up. Rattles through. 
and there's the buzzer. Kind of a quick trigger from Johnson, but he made it happen, and it's a nine-point game going into the break. Inconsistent, but he can step out and shoot the three, and he's a physical guy, too. Right away, DJ Laster into the game and makes his presence known 42 to 36. Freshman. Had some big plays in the first half. Not as quite as much production as he did against VCU. And, and speaking of production. Now the rest of the Hokies just one for 13. Right down the baseline for Johnson and he slams it home for two. 17th turnover from Gardner-Webb. Here's Blackshear Jr. back in the game. Fade and fire, battles it through. Blackshear Jr. for two. And now he's got 10 points. Trap from Tech's defense. Hokies lead by nine. Effiani for three. Down to six. Effiani cans it from the left wing. Isero first, somewhat layup that can't connect. Good job of contesting the shot. Jameson for two, and Gardner-Webb is jacked up. He hooks shot down low. Okay, going up against Isaiah Wilkins, now that Blackshear is on the bench with his third foul. Team Hokies back out in front by seven, make it nine. A man Hill scoops and scores his fourth point of the game. Six eight. There's a steal by Tech. It's Beatty. Hands it off. Yes, for Alexander Walker. Andrew out of credit alongside the coach, Mac McCarthy. Virginia Tech has built the lead back out to. Well, it was 11 points. It's back down to nine after the nice feed and finish there from Gardner Webb. Dufiel picks up the two. Good ball screen and roll for the freshman. Eight one for Alexander Walker, the sophomore. By the Hokies. Beating into the corner for Outlaw. His three ball is deflected down there. Nice job that time by Nate Johnson, the guard from Miami. Up top for Alexander Walker. Strong take and it's turned away. Dufial down low, altered that shot. Long arms, blocked several shots the other night at VCU. A man off the alley -oop from Alexander Walker. He got the steal, took it away from Perez, and a perfect feed to a Med Hill. The contact right there, Effiani trying to be aggressive with the basketball. Mid-air adjustment for Robinson finds Alexander Walker who scores it. It's another one of those guys who's really improved. Had a nice freshman year last year, had a couple big games, but look, looking to play a bigger role on this year's team. Robinson to Wilkins, his fourth, yes! Idea Wilkins nails it from the left wing. That is no good off the front of the rim from Jamison. In transition, Hill lays it in off the long alley oop again from Alexander Walker. Here's Cordwall, bounce pass down low. That's Laster. Good touch that time on the layup. VCU you know, on the opening night. There's a takeaway. That was Johnson that got in the way. Johnson, one-on-one -on -one with Outlaw for two. Really nice play by Johnson. Good tough finish by Alexander Walker, and he picks up a technical. That's the second one we've seen tonight. The first one came on Perez. Really have a chance to be an outstanding basketball team. Well, you know as a coach. Here's Laster against Blackshear Jr. That's good for two. The more potential a team or a player has, the more demanding of that player you are. Here's Effiani. Off to Johnson in the corner for Cornwall. That's deflected by Robinson. You bet. And he's found. And he pops right back up. What a pretty baseline out of bounds. Talked about special situations. Good feed to Blackshear Jr. And he finishes with contact. Great spacing. Reverse the ball. A Tallahassee native, but went to went to Gainesville to school. There's a turnover. Wonder how that played in the family. Good finish. <laughs> Somewhat notable the fact that the men's team and the women's team 
somewhat paralleled each other. Here's Beaton. That's good. Basically, the fact that there's a bunch of different people that can score on both teams. They're about winning in moments like that. I think the women's basketball team picked that up a season ago. Ahmed Hill for three. Right on through. Free ball. Wilkins gets five of those tonight. 21 points for the freshman from Winston-Salem, North Carolina. Well, Gardner-Webb's gonna fall to 0-2, losing to VCU and Virginia Tech. The Hokies start off the 2018-2019 campaign 1-0. Virginia Tech 87-59 over Gardner-Webb.